friends, Jay here, and we're bringing another head to head. This game is actually going to be pretty competitive. Pretty, pretty competitive. A lot of big plays, a lot of big plays. Um, this guy's able to move the ball on I me. Mean, pretty successful, pretty successful. Um, this game was a few days ago. I don't exactly remember exactly how it went, so. I edited it a few days ago, but I haven't watched it in a few days. But I remember there's some big plays right there. You know, I usually run the ball first play of the game. Here we're going to go to a little drag right over the middle and try to get a feel for what type of defense he was in. I think he was running a lot of cover, too, if I remember exactly, but don't quote me. And here, uh-oh, we got Reggie Bush alert. Uh-oh, Reggie Bush alert. Uh-oh, double juke. Oh, ankles. Uh-oh. Toasty! And we hit him with the toasty! The toasty back juke! <laughs> and we're going to go up 7 nothing. If you, I don't get big, that signature Reggie Bush, I don't get big plays like I used to last year, like all of the time. Seems like this year it's like you got a, ooh, nice cutback, ooh, ooh. As it, he sees I have a little inside zone defense. Uh, not, I don't have great inside zone defense of the 4-3 playbook, I have a lot better inside zone defense of the 3-4, but as an overall playbook, ooh, nice pass. As an overall playbook, I like the I like the 4-3 a lot more. I like the 4-3 as an overall, even though my inside zone but the inside zone defense on 3-4 is like, um, I have to make the play and shoot the gap, which is actually pretty easy to do. But in 4-3, my comp the computer will shoot the gap for me, so that's why I like 4-3 a lot more. But back into the game. I don't, I don't even know where I was. Here's one at fullback dive. I don't think my fullback dive defense was very good right there. No, no, spin move, spin move. Oh, it gets in. Okay, spin move. Okay, it wasn't very good right there. So he's going to tie up the game. Uh, we're going to go 7-7. Seven, seven. Um, usually, he, that play stops fullback dive. I don't know. Uh-oh, Archer falling forward. You poor little thing, you. And then here, run, I think, HP power. Why I'm running HP power, I do not know. Maybe he, uh, I rarely ever run that. Here, uh, wide open, speed out route. And we get third and one. And then we run a little FB dive ourselves. If you have been watching me for a while, you know I used to run a lot of FB dive and toss. Because a lot of people didn't have a defense for it in the beginning of the year. And they used to get a lot of flack. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is he is Sterling Sharp that quick? Sterling Sharp. Oh, he's gone. See, big plays are everywhere. They're everywhere. <laughs> and we're going to go 14 7. What the fuck popped up on my computer? Back into the game. Don't mind me. And look at John Elway. Finger pointing and shit. Holy shit. Uh, he was, I think he was in uh, Gun Tray Trips Y Tray, whatever it is, and uh, he's cutting around, cutting back. Uh, my little homie is logging on side. What do we got here? What do we got here? Uh oh, sack coming. Yeah, that's that Diamond Man press for you. Yeah, Diamond Man press. We still, I think we ran a lot of Diamond Man press. No, actually, I think this guy got me out. <gasps> he drops the ball. Now we're going to have third and 18. What do I do? do oh, more Diamond Man press. Um, if you watched the Mutt Draft Tournament. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. If you watched the Mutt Draft Tournament, you would have seen Sirius Mo ran a lot of Diamond Man Press. He's actually who I got this defense from. Oh, he had a wide open guy and he threw it to him. <laughs> That's where I got the idea. And that was like three, four months ago. Has this game been out for three or four months? Two months ago? I was watching a tournament where they use it in ranked teams. And I was like, well, ooh, there's a dot. And that's where I got the defense for. I'm probably going to see it more in Mutt now that somebody went 3 0 against other really high players running that defense. Now we got a 17 7 lead going into halftime. We like the situation that we're in. We're up by two scores. If we get one more stop, we should be able to stop them. We got the one stop, and then there we shoot the gap by ourselves. Were we in Diamond Press yet? Yeah, see? We can stop the run out of it. Just, you know. Gotta get lucky, you gotta get block sheds here, you're gonna run a little play action, and then here, oh god, I put, um, I thought he was gonna, he hot routed OBJ, I wonder if that's 99 OBJ, probably, he, uh, ooh, pressure coming in, um, he hit the C route earlier, so I put my safety in a blue zone, oh, it's fumbled, Clowney's such a glitch, and unfortunately right there, we don't recover it. And he threw him on a streak, one-on-one -on -one coverage. If you ever see one-on-one -on -one coverage, you throw it up. You're probably going to come down with it. Um, since the most recent patch, it seems like aggressive catching on one-on-one -on -one is really, really OP. So they always want to have... That's why man defense is, just seems like it should be... The defense you should probably think about running. And then, uh-oh, Portis, break a tackle. My boy Portis. Um, Clint Portis is really good. I was thinking about getting rid of him because I got that new uh, football outsider's Todd Gurley. But... I'm a Redskin fan. We can't do that to my boy. We can't do that. Yeah, get big. <laughs> got good that I got that quick touchdown. Here he's gonna go back to running. We're up by two touchdowns, so we're, we're really liking this situation that we're in. 
basically we're gonna play if he's if he scores we're gonna clock him if he doesn't score we're gonna clock him so you know I'm deaf but we're hoping against up here still running the ball I'm giving this to him because he's got to run out the time he's obviously not too comfortable for oh nice pass right over the middle looks like a skinny post type play I'm let's see now he's in five wide or no oh I went to zone oh I tried to send a heater there dotted me that's why I don't that's why I hate playing zone I'm just so susceptible to everything here run into the inside and we're gonna get the first down you can see tick 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 clock going down clock going down tick 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 and we got three minutes second and eight Todd Gurley, third and three. Do we get the first? He used it. Oh, we went to the speed out. We didn't go to the drag. We got a lot of options versus cover two. That's why we like this uh, playbook. That's why I'm using it. A lot of people like to sit in cover two press. This playbook makes it very difficult to play cover two press. Here, second and eight. All we got to do is get the first down. And we do. And we go down. And we're going to run out the clock. And uh, thank you for watching, people. This is where my opponent quits. Voyo Condias Bras. If you're new, like it. If you don't like it, hit the dislike. Subscribe, maybe. Peace.